British heavyweight contender Dillian White will continue his pursuit of a showdown with WBC world champion Deontay Wilder, especially after what transpired last weekend in Monaco. There were some rumblings of a rematch between White and his domestic rival Derek Chisora. The two heavyweights engaged in a fight of the year war back in December of 2015, with White winning a very close 12-round decision that some felt could have easily gone the other way. A few months ago, Chisora signed a promotional deal with Eddie Hearn of Matchroom with the hope of landing a White rematch. But that rematch suffered a huge blow on Saturday, when Chisora looked very lacklustre in losing a 12-round decision to Ebu world champion Ajit Kabale. He seemed unmotivated, he couldn't be bothered, White told Sky Sports. Derek is a strange character, and that shows in his performances. Sometimes he shows up, and other times he doesn't care. He's unpredictable. Even he doesn't know what will happen when he wakes up in the morning. You can never bank on someone like that. He might wake up and decide to never box again, or decide to try and become world champion. He's blown it big time. There was lots of money on the line in a big event but HES blown in. I'm very disappointed. HES just not ambitious enough anymore. White was targeting a fight with Wilder on a February date in London. But if Wilder fell through, White was hoping to fight Chisora which now means very little based on last week's performance. We tried to make the rematch back in June but it didn't happen. Next February I was expecting to fight Deontay Wilder and, if that fell through, Chisora was the backup, but now it's unlikely, White said. We will keep chasing Wilder and we will look at other options if he doesn't want it. But I think Wilder will take the fight because we're talking about mega money for him. Well see, tags Deontay Wilder Dillian White Derek Chisora.